Today marks six months since Hurricane Ian and tens of thousands of people are still waiting on insurance companies to hand over money for the damage sustained. 10 Tampa Bay Shannon Clough talked to one Northport man who, from our reporting, was able to see some financial success. One man had over $60,000 in damage and six months later, his home still isn't repaired. At first, his insurance offered him about $2,000. After our story aired, he got a $47,000 check. Unfortunately, there are thousands of people in the area who are still waiting on those checks. But the whole roof was gone. It was completely open. Peeled it off. You can just stand here and see daylight out of it. Just like this Northport home, so many saw thousands of dollars in damage. It was a disaster. Everything gone. All full of water. His insurance company wasn't going to pay what his estimate was, so he lawyered up. It may be appropriate to hire an attorney. Mark Freelander used to work as an insurance agent. Now he works in insurance research. Current data from the state shows over 700,000 claims have been filed with a total of $13 billion in damage. Some claims are not being paid. There have been a lot of disputes over whether the claim was a win-loss or a water loss. Which could mean flood insurance opposed to homeowners. And if you don't have that, they won't pay a dime. There is state help if you feel you're being shorted or ignored. If you feel you have a legitimate dispute as to your loss from the storm that's not being paid out, you could bring it to arbitration. Six months later, and there are over 143,000 claims still open. A penny hasn't been paid for over 62,000 of those. But be persistent at the same time. Don't let things go. For 10 Tampa Bay, I'm Shannon Clough.